Hi, my name is Ashley Rice and welcome to my YouTube channel. Okay, you guys, we have another Vegan Cuts unboxing and I am so excited as always. I feel like I say that in every single video. I need to come up with like a better phrase, but I'm really excited because I love getting my Vegan Cuts boxes. They are one of the highlights of my month. For those of you who don't know what a Vegan Cuts box is, it is a monthly subscription box where you get a ton of vegan goodies, whether they are snacks, sometimes there's meals, sometimes there's tea. Um, occasionally there's coffee things. It seems to be more tea than coffee and it is absolutely amazing and it is such a great way to introduce yourself to so many companies that are out there or even just to introduce yourself to vegan products because that's actually how I started off. When I first started getting vegan cuts boxes I was actually vegetarian and it opened up a whole new world to me and then I was able to see like how many vegan things there are out there and how amazing they are. So this is a great subscription box if you are just wanting to toy around with veganism or you just want to find out what other amazing vegan companies are out there. Now before I get into unboxing this bad boy if you were new to my channel I would absolutely love it if you would subscribe and click the little bell down below to receive notifications for my future videos. I have other unboxing videos. I do some reviews. I do some recipe videos and a ton of other fun things on this channel. Also make sure to give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me out and lets me know that you guys really like these vegan cuts unboxings. But other than that, let's check out what came this month. Ba -da -da -da. Alrighty. As always, every single month you get a fun little card here. It usually has a nice design. I really like this. It's like simple, but it's it's perfect for spring. On the front, it'll tell you ways that you can possibly win a free vegan cuss box, and that is awesome. And then on the back, it actually breaks down a ton of the companies that are in the box. I think there's like one or two companies that are not on this list, and I think that's just because it varies depending on like where you live, what products you get for those other two things. That's my hypothesis. But it tells you a little bit more about the products that you received and also how you can look these companies up on social media. But then there's the part that we actually want, which is the food. So let's see what we got. Okay, I'm gonna go down to the bottom. Oh, this feels interesting, what are you? Healthy Truth Cylon Cinnamon Crunch. Oh, it's oats, okay. They are organic, they have raw coconut, dates, vanilla, sprouted sunflower seeds. Ooh, I have really been getting into like everything oats recently. It's become like an obsession. It's really bad, um, but I've been loving it. So this sounds like really, really cool. And I also love the fact that it's cinnamon flavored. I love everything cinnamon. It is also gluten-free, which is awesome. Actually, a lot of the items that I get in my Bean Cuts box are always gluten-free. In fact, it's very rare if I don't have something that's gluten-free. It's also dairy-free, paleo, and sprouted certified. Hmm, this sounds like it'll be really, really yummy. I'm super excited. Okay, next, uh, let's go with this. It's a... Oh, Bob's Red Mill. Okay, awesome. Uh, it is their organic oatmeal classic with flax and chia. I really like Bob's Red Mill uh, products. They have a ton of amazing things out there and they're just a really, really great company. And so I'm super excited to get this. It is gluten-free, parv, organic, non-GMO. It is classic flavor, so I'll probably add something to this because I don't generally just do classic oatmeal. Usually I like to add like fruit into it. Cinnamon is like my go-to. If it's not flavored, I usually add cinnamon. There's that guy. Okay, let's see what else we got. You feel interesting, let's go with you. Nutzo Organic Chocolate Power Fueled Seven Nut and Seed Butter. Oh, so basically it's like a chocolate spread. I think that's what this is. <laughs> here. It's got cashews, almonds, paleo chocolate, Brazil nuts, flax seeds, chia seeds, hazelnuts, pumpkin seeds, and Celtic sea salt. Ooh, there's a lot of great things in there. It's only got one gram of sugar and three grams of protein. Very cool. I don't think I've ever heard of this company before, so I think this is a brand new company for me at least. So I'm super excited to try their uh, paleo chocolate. I wonder, like, how dark chocolatey it is because I'm assuming it's dark chocolate. Oh, it's made with eating evolved chocolate and they are a company that I'm aware of. I've actually done a review on one of their products. It wasn't really for me, but if you want to see that review, I'll link it up in an eye right there so you can check it out. Okay, I saw sun butter, so I gotta pick it up. So this is sun butter, sunflower butter, and it is creamy. I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm not a huge like peanut butter, sunflower butter, like any type of that kind of butter person. I have to be in a kick. I have tried this before. It's it's pretty good. It's not bad. It doesn't taste like peanut butter in any way, but it's a great alternative for anyone who is allergic to peanuts. But I know some people who love it. In fact, the vegan zebra, Olivia, she actually talks about this a lot on her channel, and she was really surprised when I had not heard about this company a little while back. But so I probably won't review this one on my channel. Just a little heads up. 
Sometimes I do review the products that come in my Vegan Cuts box. If there's anything that stands out to you and you really, really want to see a review on it, let me know in the comments below. But otherwise, if I don't hear anything, there are other things I would love to review on my channel, so I am going to look for those. But I would love to review anything in here that you really want to see a review on. I actually just reviewed a product not too long ago that was part of a giveaway series that is still happening on my channel every single Friday, so tune in for that. But I just tried a product that had this on the inside. They were kind of like Reese's almost. And so if you want to see that video, I'll link it up in an eye there so you can check it out that way too. Okay. Next, let's go you. What are you? Oh, oh, awesome. <laughs> Awkward story about these. Uh, but this is the Growing Roots Organic Coconut and Seed Bites, and the flavor is Pina Colada. So I actually got these in my last vegan cuts box, and then we had an ant problem. And the ants broke into this, and so I threw it out. So the other flavor actually sounded a little bit more intriguing to me. Uh, it had some sort of alcoholic beverage in it, brandy or something like that. I can't remember off the top of my head. Uh, but I don't think it had alcohol in it. It was just the flavor of it. So fun thing, if you have any recommendations on ways to deter bugs and ants from coming into your house in a very humane way that doesn't involve killing them, please let me know in the comments below. And this brand really, really intrigues me. And one thing that I love about them, and they put this right on the top here. I'm not sure if you guys could read it earlier, but it says every purchase supports Towards urban farms and I just think that's really really cool so I definitely would love to try these out I didn't get to try the other ones out which is so frustrating I should have left them in the box with all my other vegan cuts goodies but I left them out because I wanted to try them and then the ants got into them so the fun thing now that you know about my ant problem let's move on to the next one uh, let's go with this guy oh yay okay I love this company you guys uh, this is the Soulful Project, and this is the Healthy Grains and Seed Multigrain. I actually think I got this in my last Vegan Cuts box, but they are such an amazing company that I do not care if I get this in every single Vegan Cuts box. I love what they do. I love everything they stand for. They donate basically a package of this guy to a local food bank in your area, so if you buy it, they find out what area you're from because they have your address to ship it to, obviously. And then they look at some food banks that are near you, and any of them that are partnered with this company, they send one over to them. And I just think that's so amazing. And such a great way to like help out people in your area. I just, I love it. I talk a lot about it in the video where I reviewed these guys. So if you want to see that video, I will link it up in an eye. You can check it out there. It's made without sugar, which is awesome, but it also means it's very bland. Um, for me personally, I'm someone who loves really, really strong flavors. So usually with this, I add like fruit and then I'll add like cinnamon, as I said earlier with oats and stuff. I could talk about them for ages, but we have other things we got to check out. So let's find out what's next. You are Oregon Kids Bar Chocolate Brownie. Ooh, very fun. That's so cool. I didn't know they did like kids bars. I think that's really, really cool. I don't have kids, so it will be me and my husband eating this, <laughs> but I'm okay with that. I also love the design that they have. I just think that's such a fun design and perfect for kids. So very fun. I actually had one of their Oregon bars not too long ago. It was for adults, obviously. Um, it was so good. So I'm super excited to try this out and see what it's like for kids. I just think that'll be really, really cool. Let's go. Ooh, we got a beverage. Hmm. Oh, this is, oh, no, shut the front door. Okay, guys, I'm gonna try this out on my channel today because I wanna drink this so bad. Every single Vegan Cuts box, I've kind of decided there's gonna be a mystery review in here somewhere, so you'll just have to like stay tuned every single video to see which product I review. So this is Tickle Water, and the flavor is watermelon, and I love watermelon. It's probably my favorite fruit of all time. I mean, I love cherries too. Cherries, watermelon, and grapes are like all up there. But I love watermelon and the season is coming back, which makes me really, really happy. And this sounds absolutely amazing. And I'm sure my husband is gonna love this. He actually drinks a lot of sparkling water. Oh, that's cute. So there's a little owl down here. I don't know if you guys could see that, but then it says, who said water isn't cool and it's who with two O's like who, who, you know, funny. And it has no sugar, zero calories. It's non-GMO. There are no artificial sweeteners, no preservatives. It is naturally flavored sparkling water. No colors, no sodium, basically everything zero on the nutritional information. Oh, that's so cute. When my son took his first sip of sparkling water, he giggled because it tickled his tongue. From that moment on, he kept asking me for tickle water. That is adorable. I love this company already. <laughs> oh, it's also gluten-free. There is no BPAs. I think I've mentioned everything now. Okay, let's try this. I will mention this now. I'm not usually a huge fan of sparkling waters, but this just sounds amazing. And if I don't love it, my husband will. So I can guarantee that. Okay, let's try this. Oh, this is very sweet. 
Normally my issue with sparkling water is it's not sweet, but the fact that it's like naturally sweetened with watermelon, it's got a good amount of sweetness to it. Obviously it's not like candy, it's not that sweet. If you like sparkling water, you would like this a lot. Tickle water, that's just so cute. <laughs> okay, tickle water, you won my heart. I'm obsessed with you. Okay, let's look at the other stuff. Let's hear it. What are you? <gasps> tea, yes. Okay, this is Tatsu tea, hopefully I said that right. Japanese matcha tea. It has vitamins, minerals, and electrolytes. Very cool, and it comes in this like really, really awesome bag. So you get your little tea guy right here. Oh, that's cool, they give you 25% off your first purchase with them. That's really, really cool. Very cool, I like the fact that it has electrolytes in it. I just think that's really, really cool for a tea. You usually don't see that, or at least I usually don't see that. Okay, and so all you do is you shake it in 16 ounces of cold water and you enjoy. I love getting teas in my vegan cuts boxes. I know other people don't because they're not tea drinkers, but I'm a huge tea drinker, like I, have way too many teas. I need to drink more tea constantly. <laughs> okay, let's move on to the next one. What are you? You are, oh, yay! This is the Real Coconut Plantain Flower Hemp Raisin. Oh, that sounds really, really good. So I have reviewed something from the Real Coconut before if you wanna see that review. Again, it's gonna be linked up in an eye. You can go ahead and check it out. I love oatmeal raisin cookies. It's one of my favorite kind of cookies. And so hemp raisin just sounds really, really interesting to me. And I really, really want to try it like really badly. <laughs> but I really remember liking the other ones. So I'm super excited to try these puppies out. Next is gonna be this guy. It is Lundberg Family Farms Organic Grounded Snacks, Garlic and Herb. I have tried things by Lundberg's before and I've really, really enjoyed them. They are a great company. So I'm super excited to try this. I feel like my husband is gonna love this more than I will just because because he loves everything garlic. But I love chips, so I mean, no matter what, I'll eat them and I'll enjoy them. <laughs> okay, let's go with this. Ooh, what are you? <gasps> lemon. Oh, this is by Good Snacks and it's a soft and tasty lemon protein bar. I love everything lemon, so I know I'll probably love these. I'll be interested to see if it has that like protein texture though, because that's always what makes me not like protein bars is when it has that really strong protein texture. If it has a little bit, I can get over it. But when it's like really, really strong, then I have issues. Good bars are sweet on the outside and good on the inside. We hide 15 grams of plant-based protein in every soft and tasty bar. Consider it your guilty pleasure without the gills. I love that. That sounds really, really cool. Ooh. I really want this now, but I should probably save it for one of my days where I am really, really busy. In fact, I'm gonna have a what I eat in the day video coming out shortly. That's gonna be one of my busier days. So maybe I'll just try this on that day because this will be absolutely perfect. I can do this as like a snack that I eat before my theater rehearsal. And then when I get back, I usually have a little bit of a bigger meal and life is about to get really busy with rehearsals because we're getting closer to tech week. So this might be perfect to do on that video. So I think I will do this on that video so you will be able to see it that way. So if you want to get notified for when I put up the next what I eat in a day video, make sure you've clicked that bell. Okay, I saw this, gotta pick it up. This is Rind Tropical Blend Superfruit Snack. And the flavors are bittersweet, orange, pineapple, and tangy kiwi. I used to eat kiwis all the time as a child, like all the time. <laughs> this is kosher, non-GMO, gluten-free, and it is sun-dried. There are no sulfites and nothing is added. It's also high in fiber. I have had rind before. I got it in an earlier Vegan Cuts box, and I didn't try it on my channel, but I tried it just with my husband one day. We were snackish, and so we're like, dried fruit, that's probably the best option we can do. And they were pretty good. Texture-wise, they were really, really enjoyable. So I'm super excited to get another one in my box. I will definitely enjoy this, especially because it's got kiwi. That's awesome. Okay, we got, oh, I got another one. So I got two of these guys. That's awesome. Ooh, this will be perfect because then I can just give one to my husband and I can have the other one we don't have to share. <laughs> okay, then this is the last item that came in my box. Sorry, I just hit the camera. And this is going to be the Vitamin Friends Iron Vegan Gummies. And it's got iron, B complex, vitamin C, biotin, and zinc. This is like super awesome. This is more kid oriented. It is gluten free, allergy free as well. It's actually free of gluten, egg, crustaceans, fish, peanuts, milk, tree nuts, and soy. It's not recommended for children under 24 months, but it doesn't say anything about age above that. Um, it obviously does have iron in it, so this is something you do want to monitor and keep out of reach for children just because overdosing on iron is really, really bad. You do not want that to happen. And I love that they have Autism Hope Alliance. I just think that's so awesome. I love that. And you're supposed to do two of these gummies per day. I think I'm just going to try them on my channel for you guys because this is like really awesome. So you're going to get two reviews in, in a video. Hope you enjoy that. Look at that. The little bears. And they definitely are sugar coated a little bit as well. So, okay, I'm just going to try one right now. Oh, very gummy. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, that has a really nice flavor. This would be perfect for children because it's got that little sugar coatedness. So it's really, really sweet. So children would absolutely love this. It's not like chewy gummy. It does, you know, slice right through it. In fact, let me just see if I can show you guys a little bit here. Um, like if you twist it, it comes apart fairly easy. Hopefully you guys saw that. I don't really know what flavor it's supposed to be. Oh, natural berry flavor. It says over there. And it is very much a berry flavor. It isn't like specifically like, oh, it's blueberry or strawberry or anything like that. It's just sweet and it's got a little bit of a fruity flavor to it. Okay guys, that's everything I got in my Bean Cuts box. You kind of got a double whammy with the other review in there. Let me know if that's something you enjoy. I'm definitely willing to review more of them in the unboxing video. I just don't want to make these videos like really, really long because I know watching really, really long videos is not always the easiest thing for a lot of people. But super excited, guys. I think I got so many amazing things. I don't think there's one that I'm not really excited for. I mean, obviously, Probably the one I'm the least excited for is sun butter, and that's just because I'm not a big peanut butter, sun butter kind of fan. It's just not something I really jive on a lot. I have to be in a particular mood to really enjoy it. But you guys, if you have not tried Vegan Cuts, this is one subscription box I definitely would recommend. It's probably one of my favorite ones that I'm getting right now. And no, this is not a sponsored video. Vegan Cuts does not pay me to tell you this. I buy these boxes on my own. They don't even send them to me for free. Though one day if that happened, I would be very excited. So if you're gonna try any type of like vegan food subscription, definitely Vegan Cuts. They are amazing. I absolutely love them. So if you were like wondering if you should try it or not, definitely just buy one box, give it a shot and see what you think about it. They do have a one box subscription. They have a three month subscription, a six month and a full year. So that's everything I got in my Vegan Cuts box. I'm gonna put on a screen really quick everything that you can see it in one big snapshot. Obviously two of the things I did start eating or drinking. So those ones are gonna look weird. You know why. Also let me know which of these snacks you're most excited for or if you've tried some of them, what were your thoughts as well. And if you get a Vegan Cuts box, let me know what items we got different or if we got the exact same ones. I love hearing about that. I just think it's so cool that we get different things. But other than that, if you are new to my channel, I would absolutely love it if you would subscribe and click the little bell down below to receive notifications for my future videos. Also make sure to give this video a thumbs up. It really helps out my channel. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. I'm just gonna drink my watermelon tickle water. <laughs> I love that name. Ugh.